Miss Spider's Tea Party by David Kirk. See, I'm doing it here. Ready? One lonely spider sipped her tea while gazing at the sky. She watched the insects on the leaves, Eve, and many flying by. If I had friends like these, she said, hey, who would stay with a while with me? I'd sit them down on silken chairs and serve them. Some cakes and tea. This is this is the mosquito whipping his or maybe butterflies as you can see. Here we see. Look at timid beetles. Those 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 I can make crap from the woodwork for that same day. But when Miss Spider begged, please stay. He said. And dashed away. As you can see, she's actually see they shrieked. This is a really good picture. Ready? Three fireflies. He flew inside that night. Here's high, their tails alive. They spy the web and This. The little tree did not fear. They appear to be a spot. There's me. You know? Such a silly. They think it. Four bumblebees. Four bumblebees. He's buzzed by outside. Please come to tea, Miss Cried. The kind. For annoyed her swing. And there, she waved a tea towel in the air. She took a cup and tapped the glass. Then one bee spoke to her at last. We should be fools to take our tea with anyone who's so spiry. Hmm. Then the shadows There's of the room. Just peeking from behind the room, five green faces raw up and peered. Smash mouth. Her was sure. If I closer look, she danced with gloomy nook, but said, Those jolly mugs. Bah, long glass to robber bugs. Look at these three. Let's see. I don't want to think. Give her to lunch. Simon strode in. In, in number six. That ends with spiders. Well, not mix. She brew them tea from hips, hips of hips of roses. She found platoon turned up in there. You know. So you're ready. They're angry at that. Banquet concealed its surprise. Seventy dainty butterflies with spider watching them from the wall. We're not aware of them. Oh. <laughs> mama, 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 me, 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 me. Sat a sea. The tea table was set for eight. Saucers, cup, and silver plate. Get the cake refreshed and serve tea that no one would arrive to the company in no demand. Left her cup for every hand. So she's very sad. For that, that's for the cakes. Nine spotted moths. What's but it's kept safe, safe and warm in shelter from a thunderstorm. They stood beneath an open sash, and what is a jagged lightning flash? Miss Spider dropped down on a, a silver tray above her head. She 
I hope them to please them, but instead, this is they flew away in mortal dread. He left me all alone, she cried. He tapped her eyes and said, listen, this plane no bug will ever stay. She was splashed upon a tree. Then, ten, ten tiny steaming tubs of tea were pushed on top of her trembling knees. She sipped and sobbed, and then she heard a cough. She heard a cough. She turned to see a small with moth, a fragile thing. She said, a thing. His wings were too damp to fly again. See, he. <laughs> he, he smiled and took a checkered cloth and cloak for fra you know, and thin, the frail and thick. The frail. This looks frail and thick. Cloak of moth. They talked and smacked on. And tea and pie until the teeny his tiny wings were dry. Then lifting her up and, and the tender care, he tossed them she tossed them gently in the air. So here jump it off with the plate. And sure he is. You can see wants the there's the cake. And then something really me Early happened gracefully. The moth told Ike about. Then Ike, Ike told me. He went from bug to mug to say, "There's no reason for alarm. She never meant just any harm." So later on, that evening, seven, so in the dining room, eleven and six came to see to share Miss Spider's courtesy. With twelve, twelve tender vlogs and a plate presented in a spider's place. She sat by her hair and newly spun. And she munched the blossoms one by one. Her friends were glad to watch her feast upon the mortals. It was, it was a great relief to see she he ate the flowers and drank just tea. It was just by his re reception grew. Before too long, our hoist his, his new, each bug who crawled or hopped or flew, and all their love, children too. The end.